Hello, today we will discuss about phase velocity and group velocity. Phase velocity. The phase velocity of a wave is the rate at which the phase of a wave propagates in space. This is the velocity at which the phase of any one frequency component of the wave travels. The phase velocity is equal to Vp is equal to omega by k, where omega is the angular frequency and k is the wave number. Here in this short animation, you will see the red and green dots. The red dot is representing the phase velocity, where the green dot is representing the group velocity. The phase velocity is the velocity of a single phase of a wave. Derivation of phase velocity. This is a wave equation. According to wave equation, this where y is equal to a sine kx minus omega t where this a is the amplitude and kx minus omega t is the phase. Now taking this term equal to 0 and then solving we will get kx is equal to omega t. Transferring this minus omega t from the left hand side to the right hand side this minus omega t will become will become plus omega t. Now dividing both sides by kt we will get x by t is equal to omega by k and finally vp is equal to omega by k and this equation represents the phase velocity. Now what is the group velocity? Group velocity of a wave is the velocity with which the overall shape of the wave's amplitude known as the modulation or envelope of the wave propagate through space. Mathematically, the group velocity can be written as Vg is equal to d omega by dk. Remember, the phase velocity was Vp is equal to omega by k, but here this group velocity is in differential term d omega by dk differentiating angular frequency with respect to wave number the group velocity is equal to phase velocity when the refractive index is constant and we know according to the definition of refractive index refractive index is the ratio between the speed of light c and the phase velocity vp which is n is equal to c by vp. Solving this equation for pairs velocity, vp will become equal to c by n. c is the speed of light and n is the refractive index. And according to the definition of phase velocity, the phase velocity is equal to omega by k. Comparing these two equations, we will get omega by k is equal to c by n. Solving for omega, you will get omega is equal to c k by n. Now differentiating this term with respect to k, you will get d omega by d k is equal to c into d by d k into k n power minus 1. This c is the speed of light and the speed of light is constant so we do not need to differentiate the c, we will only deal with the k and 1 over n. Using the product rule, we will get d omega by dk is equal to c 1 over n. Taking differential of k with k, then we'll be, oh, we will be left with 1. So we do not need to write that. We will get 1 over n minus k into 1 over n squared into dn by dk. Further simplifying this equation, we will multiply this c with this term. We will get d omega by dk is equal to c by n minus ck by n square dn by dk. Now from this equation, this term c by n is equal to the pairs velocity. Here, pairs velocity is equal to c by n. So the group velocity vg is equal to d omega by dk is equal to pairs velocity minus speed of light wave number divided by refractive index square dn by dk. Now here if this dn by dk term is equal to 0, the group velocity is will be equal to the phase velocity.
when this whole term becomes zero then this d omega by dk will be equal to vp it means that the group velocity will be equal to pairs velocity if the refractive index is constant from this equation it this equation further clarifies that the group velocity is less than the pairs velocity here from this equation you see this is the group velocity is equal to pairs velocity minus ck by n square d n by dk minusing this whole term so the group velocity can never surpass the speed of light but phase velocity can surpass the speed of light uh, but actually we need the group velocity to transfer the information from one place to another uh, that's why the speed of light is constant thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe and comment your questions thank you